Hey everybody, this is Anthony from Into the Dark Room, and I'm going to show you how to build a navigation, your navigation buttons in the back end of WordPress for our blog site. So, first thing we're going to do is roll over appearances, and we're going to click on the menus button. And this is the area that's going to allow us to build some navigation items. So, I'm just going to jump right into it and show you how to build some uh, navigation items pretty quickly. So, I'm going to come down to this pages area. And I'm going to go ahead, I've already made these pages, and if you haven't made pages, you can see how to make pages in a previous video. But I'm going to go ahead and check off the pages that I want to include in my menu. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, check them off and hit Add to Menu. And they are now going to add up here. So now I can very simply uh, drag them around. So let's say I want my About to be first, and I want my Contact to be last. Maybe I want my Home up here. Um, and and that all works for me. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, I'm gonna go ahead and save this. So I'm gonna come over here and save it. And those are the basic buttons that I have in there. But let's say under the blog button, I want to go ahead and have the categories. And you do have the option to take the categories and put them in a sidebar in most of our blog sites. Um, but if you wanted them to to look like a drop down, I'm gonna show you how to do that. So. I'm going to scroll down here to our categories area and I'm going to click view all and I'm going to go ahead and just click on the categories that I want to add and every time you add a new category you have to come back here and and go ahead and add it so I'm going to go ahead and check on the ones that I want I'm going to add to menu and what's going to happen is you're going to see them all spill out right into here and I'm going to go ahead and move them now but what I'm going to do is I'm going to indent them under the blog and that means that it's going to become a sub navigation so here's a here's another one and move my portraits up there and then my personal and um, that is going to be my sub navigation that lives under my blog so I'm gonna go ahead and hit save and now let's say I want to link to let's say like a shopping cart or something external I'm gonna show you how to do that so what you would do is you would come over to this custom link and you would type in www. and whatever the URL is. Just for now, I'm going to type Google just to show you that we can link externally. And I'm going to I'm going to title it um, uh, client uh, cart. And I'm going to go ahead and click Add to Menu. And you're going to see that it added to the bottom here. And maybe I want to move it up above the contact and then I'm going to go ahead and hit save. So once I have all my navigation built out, um, I want to show you that you can come in here and if you have to, you can edit it by clicking on the little arrow. So if you want this to say about me, um, or you can remove it, um, and you can even you can even uh, um, cancel what you're doing right now. So if you didn't want to change it, if you do change anything in here, you can go ahead and come down here make sure you hit save so that it does update now this navigation is not going to appear until we actually um, add it to this theme location so we're going to use this drop down and we are currently under this tab right here we're going to use this drop down and we're going to associate it with the tab that we're on and again uh, in different templates we may have different tabs up here uh, we might we might separate the tabs so they go around the, the logo if the logo centered uh, we may have a different type of uh, navigation uh, tabbing system so you're just going to want to make sure that you're building out the tabs appropriately and then there will be options over here to determine where they're located so you're just going to want to make sure that you add the tab of of navigation buttons to this location over here and then you just click save and that is how you create a navigation uh, menu and I hope that was informative I hope that uh, kind of gives you a quick overview of how to create tabs. If you have any additional questions, don't hesitate to contact us through support. And uh, you could probably find more information at IntoTheDarkRoom.com. Thanks again, guys.